Hey guys, I don't know if you can see, but I just got out of the gym. This is the new 24-hour fitness that they built over here. It's huge. Um, Let's refocus. Anyways, day two, and I'm at the gym with no problem. Went straight here, didn't even like deliberate about it. Nothing it was awesome. I like that feeling where I don't have, I don't feel like, oh my gosh, I'm sacrificing, I have to go to the gym, whatever. But I got to tell you, I got to thank <laughs> you vloggers out there because I would not have gotten through 40 minutes of the Stairmaster without watching you guys. Whoa, who's that person in the back? <laughs> you can see a bunch of people walking behind me. I hope they're not watching me saying, what the hell is she doing? Anyways, um, yeah, I watched the vlogs the entire time. So I figure if I can get six to eight of you guys to vlog every day then I'll have a full playlist of stuff to watch while I'm um, doing cardio and I swear to god it makes it so much faster it's like I finished I was watching squeaker wood for example and as soon, when she was done I was like oh I'm, I'm already I've already done eight minutes you know it's like awesome so keep it coming um and you're really gonna help me out uh, I just want to do, I just want to talk about some people because because I got to watch vlogs and um, I've commented on all of them, but I also would want, like to bring it up. I want to welcome Terry back into the fold, um, gyroplane fan, because I just love you. I hope you're watching right now because um, uh, I am going to be very excited to, you know, watch your vlogs every week and see your um, success because you're so good at it. You know it. You can do it. Um, and, you know, see, like I said, I watched Squeaker Wood, Just Maintain Girl, until it's time to, you know, get back on a round. And I'll be on a round with you, or on some kind of diet, <laughs> to get, um, I want to try to get back to 130. You know, I'm at, I fluctuate right now from between 135 and 140. And um, I have not surpass 140 yet which is whew, good because I do not want to do that during the holidays it just makes it extra hard to get it off after which you know I don't want that um I saw who else did I watch today I watched um Susie uh Susie's doing well I know the roller coaster ride on the scale is crazy but you know who cares as long as you're not gaining tremendous amounts of weight and you're just going up and down that's what we do we're women we go up and down um and um uh, I just had a dirty thought in my mind when I said that but <laughs> get your mind out of the gutter um and then uh Marie and uh, your hubby, um, what's his name again? No, I'm just kidding. Sergio. Sergio. Que te pasa, mio? <laughs> That's my little Spanish for today. Um, uh, I, I hope you guys are doing well. Um, you got to stop her, Sergio. Sergio, Sergio, Sergio. I'm going to say your name all the time, so you have to watch my vlogs. Um... Gotta stop that girl from cheating, man. I know she's gonna probably bite your head off if you try to stop her, but because I'm like that and I just like do that to my husband too. But you know, he didn't, he doesn't give up. He just keeps doing it. In fact, he's the reason why I've been at the gym. Like, usually I say, you know, the more you say it, the more I wanna rebel and not go. And you know, and I just like something switched in my head and I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna listen to him. I'm gonna do it for him. Not for him, but like, I'm going to do it because he motivated me and not not someone else, you know. And um, it actually is working weird, right? And I've been sending him, like, I've been taking pictures of the treadmill or wherever I am in the gym and, like, sending it to him saying, saying have a great day, you know. And it's, he's like, good job, babe, you know. Probably thinks I'm nuts, but, um, yeah, we just got to... We just got to try to support each other. And that's another reason why I'm glad that um, Terry's back in the fold and back on the vlog because... Um, and if you guys aren't subscribed to him, he's Gyroplane Fan. And he has come a long way. He's lost tremendous weight, you know. And, you know, he he's fun to watch. Because 
he's successful at it. And, you know, no matter what the ups and downs we have, we cheat, you know, he cheats, whatever. He's still, you know, successful like all of us are pretty much. I mean, we, we can't really beat ourselves up every time we mess up. We, in some way or another, or at some point or another, we do get to some kind of mini goal or whatever. So we should really like praise those times when we get to our mini goals. You know, sometimes we're like, oh, I didn't get to 125. I suck. I'm a loser or whatever. Um, but no, you you should look at the, the small stuff. Like I lost five pounds though, you know, something like that. Or like I would never have lost five pounds without um, sticking to this in some way or another, you know. So that's kind of how we have to look at it and always look at the successes that we um, experience rather than the failures. That's how I see it. Or else we'll just keep being depressed and like locking ourselves in our rooms and staying under the covers all day long. <laughs> Drama. Um, anyways, so I am totally energized because I went to the gym. And I am going to go do a couple more errands. I, my nephew, let me fix my hair. Look, there, my hair is fixed. Anyways, um, I wanted to talk about hair because, you know, Sergio says we gals always talk about hair. What? Um, do some errands. I'm going to buy some rainbow looms. Like, they're not even sick of that yet. But my nephew asked for that. And I got a, um, oh, I can't wait to show you guys the quilt. The quilt, uh. I made um, and the quilt pillows. I'm very proud of them because I never quilt. I mean, I can make elaborate costumes and dresses and stuff, but for some reason, reason making a quilt was quite daunting for me because I was looking at all these amazing quilts at church and I was like, there is no way I can do that. And actually, there is no way I can. I just did it very simple, but still, I'm still proud of it. But when I'm done, um, I'll take a picture of it and show you guys. But I um, got to go to Joanne's today and buy some pillow stuffing. Um, cause I did not make standard size pillows, so I can't just stuff a pillow in it. But, um, yeah, if you guys have any tips on stuffing a pillow, let me know. I don't want my pillow, I don't want their pillow to be like all messed up, you know, by next year. I want it to kind of keep its shape and all that. So I'll ask around at Joanne's, but if you guys have some tips, let me know. Um, and that's it. I'm sure I have a lot more to say because I did watch more than three vlogs. Um, and uh, yeah, but I, I'm just going to make this vlog like super long. And unless you're on the treadmill, you won't appreciate it. Oh, Kathy. 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 Challenge is on, girlfriend, in 2014. I know. It's always been you and me like challenging each other because we're always kind of, at, we're the same, right? Um, to the, we're the same to the point where I am like eyeing my kids goldfish girl. It's on the shelf. I have an open pantry right now where, I mean, it's just like shelves on the wall and I'm just like goldfish, goldfish. <laughs> I've actually been really bad. Um, someone asked me if I was doing P3 or P4. I'm actually, um, in P4 now, but um, I, I thought I was in P3, but I wasn't really keeping track. So I think I'm about, I'm in P4 now, um, this week. I ate, I've been eating one or two Lindor truffles every day. Yes. And why do I do that? Because I'm not just saying this to justify it, but candy, like chocolate, it doesn't affect me. Um, I don't gain weight from that, especially if I'm eating like one truffle. I know there it's calorie um, dense because it's butter and all that stuff. But um, I'm more affected with um, uh, starch. Everyone knows that. Rice, bread, that's me. And salt, you know, if I don't drink, get my water in. So it's been really, really hard to get water in when I'm not on P2. So I really need to force myself. And use my app and make sure I'm listening to my app. Because my app is going on all day and I'm like, eh, you know, ignore or whatever. And I can't do that. I really got to start carrying my jug around um, like I did on P2 and get the water in. The water is, it's like night and day, guys. Like when I don't have water, it's like not being on any kind of healthy regimen or anything. I either gain or I don't. I feel like shit or something. My skin looks like crap or whatever. 
I really, really need to get the eight glasses of water in at least. So I'm really going to try to do that this week, especially because I'm working out. I hope I've motivated most of you to work out. Um, my vlog's long, so I got to stop it or else you guys aren't going to watch it. But um, I, I hope I've motivated you to, to not like wait and just say, you know what, I'm just going to take a walk today. I wasn't in the gym for that long. I was literally in there for 45 minutes. And it's only because I had to go to the locker and go to the bathroom and stuff like that. But I did the treadmill for 30 minutes. I did um, sit-ups, push-ups, um, some back exercises for about 10 minutes. And then I'm back in here. I didn't even go back into the locker room because there's a locker out in the gym area. And I just like got my jacket out, just went back to the car, you know. It seems simpler like that and not make it a big, you know, big uh, production, you know. That w that way it's like, it's over and you did it and it's like, wow, I actually went to the gym today. I forgot, you know. And that's how you want to feel. You want it to be like part of your routine where you actually forgot you did it. Um, and that's it. So I hope you guys get to the end of this vlog because I want you to hear that. So um, I will talk at you guys again tomorrow. I love ya. Peace out.